In the late 1950s, sheep in the mountains of Idaho gave birth to one-eyed lambs. It turned out that pregnant sheep were grazing on a wildflower that was loaded with a dangerous chemical called cyclopamine. Now, 40 years after that incident, it was discovered that cyclopamine inactivates a protein called smoothin. Now, smoothin is this fascinating molecular machine which is present in all animals. It's active before birth and controls our early development. Smoothin makes sure that all of us have the same body plan, the same brain architecture, two eyes, five fingers, and so on. Defects in smoothin during development can cause these devastating disorders, not just in sheep, but also in humans. And to make things worse, smoothin can go rogue in adults, become hyperactive, and cause skin and brain cancer. And as you can imagine, anti-cancer drugs that inactivate smoothin are used in the clinic but these drugs are not very effective, simply because we don't know enough about smooth and activation and how to inactivate it. So my hypothesis was, if we are able to determine the structure of active smoothen, we can gain insights into smooth and activation. And therefore, the two specific aims of my research are to take a three-dimensional photograph of active smoothen, and based on that, design smarter drugs to inactivate smoothen and hopefully treat disease. Earlier this year, I was able to generate a high resolution snapshot of active smoothen. Amazingly, a molecule had photobombed smoothened. This molecule was cholesterol, the same waxy substance that flows in our blood. In that photo, this cholesterol molecule was stuck deep within a pocket inside smoothened. Interestingly, this cholesterol molecule was not seen in photos of inactive smoothened. So our team thought that maybe this cholesterol is critical for smoothen activation. To test this, we took cholesterol away from smoothen and smoothen became inactive. We then gave back cholesterol to smoothen and smoothen became active again. I am super excited that we have discovered this activation epicenter of smoothen, especially because blocking this activation epicenter might cure disease. Current drugs in the market developed without this knowledge do manage to block the activation epicenter, but only partially. It's a bit like hitting a pinata, but blindfolded. But now we can clearly see the pinata and design smarter drugs. My smoothen photograph is a step forward in treating disease. Thank you.